so for today's video guys i'm gonna be showing you how to get modded or rare outfits in gta so the types of outfit you could get are like the ones i'm showing you right here you could get the checkerboard ones you could get like the tron with checkerboard outfits or you could get the blue left, and white joggers Why? also so the first thing you want to do is um you want to make sure that you have no tattoos or no face paint or no um highlights in your hair you just want to make your character look basic like a bum boy so just take every thin off your character so right now i'm just going to take off all the tattoos on my character and the face paint and the contacts and everything and you also want to make sure that you set your um spawn location to last location because i've got to show that in the video you also want to make sure that you've eaten a bird peyote in single player i'm going to leave a link in the description to the bird peyote that i ate so it works with all the um, birds except for like only two of them. I know that one of the birds that it doesn't work with is the chicken. But other than the chicken and um, I think maybe the pigeon, I'm not really sure. It works with um, the rest of them. So we're just going to take um, the tattoos and everything of our character. The, um, the hair color and everything. Just make him look basic. So that's what I'm going to do in this first part of the video. And then after we've done this, we're going to put a basic outfit on our character also and i'm gonna show you guys the outfit that i put on my character so you guys could copy that too this is going to look so good so now that we're done taking everything off our character i'm going to show you guys the outfit that i got on right now so you want to come to um the shirt section you want to go to t-shirts and put on any baggy t-shirt that you have on so i'm going to go to t-shirts and I'm, i put on the black baggy one but yeah and then you want to go to pants and i think you go to sport pants yeah you go to sport pants and put on any um sport pants you want and you want to go to shoes and go to skate shoes and i think i got the black skate shoes on also, you guys want to make sure that you have um, a parachute you on your character that. and a forward-facing cap. So now I'm just going to get any forward-facing cap from the um, clothing store. And now after you've done this, you want to um, save the outfit. So yeah, you guys can copy this outfit if you want, you know, take the gloves off your character, all that. Just make him look basic, like a noob. So uh, after we're done making the outfit, we're just going to um, save it. So after you're done saving the outfit, you just want to open your map and you want to go over to um, where the tri time trial is on your map. Now depending on when you watch this video, it might be in a different location for you, but you just want to make your way over to wherever it is on the map for you. Now when you get over there, you want to make sure, I'm not going to be able to use my oppressor, so I just took an NPC vehicle. You just want to take a personal vehicle, an NPC vehicle, and you just want to come over here to um, the time trial. And make sure that you save the outfit that we just made and make sure that you got it on. So now that you over here at the time trial, you just want to start up the time trial. And then when you start it up, just go into story mode. So make sure you put your spawn location on last location and you've eaten the bird peyote in um, a single player. So now I'm going to show you guys um, the next step when we spawn in single player. So when you spawn in single player, all you're going to want to do is go into director mode so we're just gonna get out of our car and go inside director mode if you get his alert just decline it or accept it i don't really know what it does but yeah, you just want to go into director mode so once you get into director mode you want to head over to actors and then you want to go to animals by press back by accident so we're just going to go to actors animals and then press y to shortlist whichever um animal you're going to use and now when you're done that you just want to go down to online characters and select whichever character that you're using for the um, glitch so just press y on the character that you're using for the glitch so you can shortlist it now you just want to go to shortlist actors and you just want to um, put a rubber band on your l stick so um it switches between your online character and the um, animal that you're using 
now if you've done everything right so far your bird is going to start to duplicate like you see right here so um you just want to um leave your controller over here for about 25 minutes but yeah so when you once your birds start duplicating you just want to leave your control over here for about 25 minutes and come back to it so all we're looking for is our character to spawn on top of the hay bale so i waited the um 25 to um 30 minutes and now i'm going to show you guys um what it looks like so yeah right here i think our character yeah our character spawned on top of the hay bale now when a character spawns on top of the hay bale and he disappears like mine did you just want to um, hit the L stick so it goes down and go back to the animals. You just want to make sure your character stays on top of the hay bale. As you can see, my um, went back to the trailers, but we want him to stay on top of the hay bale. So just keep on doing this, and then he should stay on top of the hay bale. So all we're waiting for is our character to stay on top of the hay bale. So when he stays on top of the hay bale, like this right here, and he has this outfit on with a checkerboard. You just want to um, press B to back out. So you want to make sure he's on top of it with the jeans and the um, checkerboard pants. I mean checkerboard shoes. Now you just want to um, press B to go back. And you want to go to actors. So we're going to press B. We're going to go to actors. And we're going to go down to emer emergency services. Now if you come to emergency services and this happens to you where you can see the um, officer. You just want to go back into shortlist actors. And then you just want to um, press down on your L stick one more time so your character to, could go on top of the hay bale. So now that our character is back on top of the hay bale, we're just going to press back. And we're going to go to actors. And we're going to go back to emergency services. Now when this happens, you want to go to LSPD. And you just want to press X on it or whatever button that says appearance. So you just want to... um. Um, keep pressing that button until you find the outfit you like now the outfit Has to have a Christmas mask on it if the outfit doesn't have a Christmas mask on it You're not gonna be able to save it I'm gonna leave a link down in the description or something on the description to um, show you guys what all the Christmas mask look like So we just want to make sure the outfit has a Christmas mask on it or you're not gonna be able to save the outfit so um, In a little bit right here. We're about to find the outfit that we're gonna take online so we found an outfit right here that had a Christmas mask on it. So when you find the outfit you want, just hit Y to shortlist it. And then just press B and go back to your shortlist actors. And just go down to the outfit that you shortlisted. It should say LSPD or your third outfit, whatever. And then you just want to um, select A so your character can walk out of the trailers. Now this outfit actually isn't that bad. As you can see, we got the Gor I think it's the Gorka um, joggers. And we got the orange vest, and I think we got like two or three layers of um, shirts on it. So when you find the um, when you um, I mean when you spawn in, you just want to walk around for a little bit, so the game could save. So after you walked around for a little bit, you just want to hold down on your D-pad and select the story mode character, and it's gonna ask you if you want to exit director mode, and just click OK. So when you um exit director mode, and you you should spawn in story mode with the outfit that you chose now you just want to walk around here for a little bit so the game could also save and now after you've done that you just want to hit pause you want to go to online and then you want to go to um, invite only session so when you load into the invite only session it might kick you out it probably will kick you out but when it kicks you out just go back it's going to kick you out into story mode and you just want to go into story mode again and just select um invite only session and you should spawn in gta 5 online with um the outfit that you want if you did everything right so far and your outfit didn't have any black listed components on it so now we're just gonna load in online and it should kick us but if it doesn't kick you just go ahead and go save the outfit but most of the time it's gonna kick you out of the game so right here we're gonna get kicked out we're just gonna press ok and it's gonna spawn us back into story mode so we're gonna just load back into story mode and we're just gonna go back we're gonna press pause we're going to go to online and then we're going to go to um, invite only session.
so now we're just gonna spawn in online with our outfit now if you spawn in and you get kicked again you just want to close the game and um just get back on gta and then you want to just quickly go save the outfit but if it didn't kick you like it didn't kick me you just want to also make sure you save the outfit so the outfit doesn't disappear so that's going to be it for this video guys don't forget to like it drop a like on it um subscribe to the channel if you already haven't and if you have any questions about the glitch just tell me down in the comment section down below